It means so much to me. It means everything to me. It's still a surreal feeling. I haven't had time to really process everything, so I'm I'm so excited. I can't wait um, to just go home tonight and really enjoy this moment and, and take it all in. It, it's amazing. From that moment when you first started dreaming about winning a Grand Slam when you were a, a little girl to this moment here, how would you describe your journey as a player? I think you know, winning my first Grand Slam and at, on top of that, um, becoming world number one again. It's, uh, I, I couldn't have scripted it any better. And, you know, I think ups and downs are part of life and a part of sports, but, um, you know, I never give up. And I just, you know, kept fighting and kept working hard and in the hopes and dreams of, of reaching this point one day. And you said fighting. It was a fight. It was exciting to watch, an amazing final. Was it as exciting for you? It definitely was. Obviously, as a player, you kind of want to win a little bit more comfortably, but at the same time, you know, Simone is an unbelievable player. And I think, you know, being here in this moment after such a grind and such a tough fight um, makes it extra special. So you're back at number one. It's your first Grand Slam title. What could this mean for the rest of your career? I don't know. I haven't thought that far yet. Um, you know, I'm just really excited and proud of uh, being here as world number one and uh, Australian Open champion.